Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings here. Mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. As always, if you are already subscribed, thanks so much for being here. I really appreciate all of your continued support. Today I have my Tea Prey Love Box to share with you. This is a fantastic wellness subscription. One of the things that I like about Tea Prey Love is it is bi-monthly, which really allows you to take the time to enjoy and use the products before you receive your next box. They have two different subscription tiers. They have their petite box for $29.95 plus shipping, which is what I used to get, or they have their premier box, which is what I have since upgraded to, and that is $39.95 plus $6.95 in shipping. If you're interested in subscribing to Tea Pray Love, I will leave a link and code in the description box below, but the code is just Noel 10 and that will save you 10% on your your own subscription. One of the other things that I really like about Tea Pray Love is they have recently added a coffee option. Now I do love tea, especially in the cooler months of the year, but I have so much tea from different subscriptions and places that I have gone that I could never go through all of it, but I drink coffee every single day. So I appreciate having that option so that again, it is going to be something that I consume and use. Now it comes in this very pretty fuchsia box with a little lotus there on the top and it's pretty hefty this month so I'm excited to get into it with you guys and see what we have so let's just open it up on the inside we just have everything kind of wrapped up in like foam paper with a little sticker sealing it so that does make it really easy to open up and it's great to save for packing other things right on top we have their product pamphlet and it says right in the front what's in your box so let's find out on the inside, we have a message from Chinwe, the owner. It says, this September calls for growth and evolution as we continue to adjust to a new world. View new beginnings as opportunities for maturation and elevation. Transform areas of your life that are barren and stagnant into rich growth. Accept or make changes so that you can evolve into the individual you intend to be and the life you intend to have. Grow, grow, grow. I hope that this wellness box satiates your mind, body, and soul as always. Make time for you to enjoy your artisan tea or coffee, your clean and luxe skincare, your mindful book items, and more. Thank you for being a part of our family. And then it's organized really nicely on the inside. On this section, we have all of the items that are in the petite and premier boxes. Right over here, we have the two items that are only in the premier box. And then finally, we have a little paragraph telling us about the coffee if you did do the coffee option. So she does include all of the retail values, which you guys know that I love having the retail values in a product sheet because it allows me to feel like I'm getting my money's worth, sometimes getting an even higher value than what I paid. And then that way I can really focus on the products and enjoy them a little bit more. So I'm just going to place that in front of me so that I can reference it as we get into the items in the box. Now the first thing I am seeing right on top is an Apa Vita Express Beauty Face Mask in Green Clay. So it looks like it's got like two packets and based on the instructions on the back, it looks like maybe it's two packets that you mix together. Now I'm really bad about doing face masks where you have to mix it up in a little bowl and then apply it to your face and rinse it off. I'm even bad at doing sheet masks, but I'm trying to be a little bit better. So baby steps, maybe I'll get there one of these days, but let's see if this is in here. Sometimes they just include little extras so it doesn't necessarily have to appear in here and I'm not actually seeing it in here so it looks like it might just be a nice little extra so that's kind of cool so now we've got a book and usually the books are in the premiere boxes um, so it looks like that's the case here so it's wrapped up in plastic which is nice um, and it's not every single month or every two months that you get it in the premiere box. I'd say I've only gotten a couple different books from Tea Pray Love. So we got a little bookmark, which is cute, from Tea Pray Love. One side says, find a reason to smile today. And it's got this pretty, like, floral watercolor. And on the other side, it's got another pretty floral watercolor that says, don't let the world dim your light so I have been reading more because of all these fun book subscription boxes that I get, you guys. And I love having like a special bookmark for each one. So that's kind of a nice little treat. Now the book itself is called 
Why Bother? Discover the Desire for What's Next by Jennifer Loudon. So here is what that looks like. This has a $16.95 value. And let's read a little bit about it. It says, in Why Bother, personal growth expert Jennifer Loudon challenges you to open your mind, your heart, and your life by following where the question leads. Through reflection and stories from others, Loudon demonstrates how to bother when it feels impossible or like too much work, whether after professional defeats, heartbreak, illness, or life-changing loss. She shows you why you must prioritize what's calling you at any time of your life, especially when you've sidelined your dreams to raise kids, pay the rent, or take care of aging parents. And crucially, she shows you how tapping into your deepest desires can give you the energy to move forward even when the world seems in such dire straits. It's time to reclaim the dignity and beauty of your desires it's time to get your bother on so I don't usually read uh, like nonfiction books like this but I do think that if any year has a year for reading some inspirational words to kind of get us motivated to sort of stoke some ambition some fire this is the year where I feel like a lot of us could use that extra bit of, of help so maybe I'll take a look at it and kind of see what it what it has to say one of the little blurbs, one of the little quotes on the back says, Why Bother spoke to me as if I were speaking to myself. It has become my guide, my map, my Bible, my confidant. I want everyone I know to own a copy as tattered as mine. So that's a pretty good um, review. So that sounds sounds like something that I can definitely flip through. We'll see. Lately, I've really just been into uh, kind of escapism through thrillers and mysteries and all of that. But, you know, reading a little bit and feeling like I can can accomplish more versus less in this crazy time sounds like a good thing to to read up on so all right let's let's move on to some of the other items I'm just going with like the biggest stuff first so I'm seeing something all wrapped up in bubble wrap and this it looks like is the other item that's just in the premiere boxes so we're kind of going in reverse order and doing our extra premiere items and then we'll go back to the items that were in everyone's box so it's a really pretty mug and it says be a wildflower in a field of roses and I really like the shape of this mug it's nice and tall it's kind of got this pretty watercolor background and then like the outline of flowers in gold now I have a lot of mugs I Actually, I don't have like a lot of mugs. I just have one shelf for mugs in my very small kitchen and it is full. So a lot of the times I'll save mugs because they do make such great gifts. And we are sort of getting into that time of year where it's time to start thinking about gifting. Um, but this is really pretty. So we'll see, maybe it makes it into the rotation. Let's see what they have to say about this pretty mug. It has a $9.99 value. The wildflower mug is a fun and empowering reminder to always be yourself and be unique as you enjoy your daily tea or coffee. This colorful and sassy common grounds design features a pastel watercolor background with golden floral, yellow floral outlines crafted of durable stoneware and holds 11 fluid ounces. Now, let's see what it says about Yes, it says microwave safe and dishwasher safe. That already brought it up a few rows on my mug uh, list of keepers. So I do like being able to drink my coffee and give it a quick rinse and stick it in the dishwasher. All right, so let's look at some of the items that were in everyone's box. We've got another little bubble wrap package and this one looks like I might need to cut it open because it is sealed and bubble wrap can be a little challenging to get the sticky flap open. Now it's interesting, there's like a little organza bag in there that I'm not actually seeing anything in. I'm wondering if there was supposed to be like a little spoon or something. So this is, it actually is branded by Tea Pray Love, which is surprising. I haven't actually seen their items in their own boxes before, but it looks like it is some rose soaking salt, very pretty little jar. Now, as some of you know, if you've been watching my channel for any time, I'm not a huge fan of rose scents, but lately I've received a few things that weren't super strong and they didn't have that artificial rose scent. They really smelled like real roses, which I do enjoy. 
So I'm hoping that's the case with this. So it says it has a $14 value. Let me see. I feel like it's it's either sealed or it's on very tightly. It says, with a passion for giving our subscribers the best, we crafted this soothing soak with your body in mind. Pure Epsom salt and pink Himalayan salt are blended together to reduce inflammation and stress. Dried organic rose petals from our very own garden. That's awesome. And phthalate-free fragrance oils provide a light, refreshing scent to enhance relaxation. This salt can be used in a warm bath or to soak just your feet and hands, which is probably how I would use it because I don't uh, necessarily take baths. I unscrewed the top, you guys, and it does have a seal, but there was so much extra that it kind of spilled out everywhere. So I'm a little bit nervous because now it's all over my desk, but I did want to give it a smell. It does have like, it looks like a dried rose petal in there. I don't know if you guys can see that and I don't want to tip it too far, but I'll definitely take some pictures for you over on Instagram. So it does definitely have a strong rose scent, but again, if it, 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 maybe I'm starting to like rose scents a little bit more because it's not too cloying to me. Um, it's just a little bit messy, so I'm definitely going to have to uh, do a little cleanup here before I film any more videos today. But like I said, $14 value, definitely something that I can either pass on to someone who enjoys baths more than me or who enjoys rose scents more than me. I'm not sure that I would be able to keep inhaling that scent for a long period of time, but I'm curious, maybe my like scent profile and preferences are changing as I get older. All right, let's see what else we've got. So this is a library of flowers for get me not shower gel. So this is, you know, from Margo Elena, which I did subscribe to their box, but they were sold out like three seasons in advance. So I don't think I get a box from them until like winter, but this is a nice size, right? So this is eight fluid ounces. That's like a full size uh, shower gel. And I do like shower gels. So I don't know all of their scents like offhand. So I'm wondering, this is probably sealed and it says it is sealed so I'm not going to open it up because there was a little variation here you could have gotten a library of flowers hand cream that had a $20 value a perfume cream at $21 or the shower gel which is what I got which is a $22 value so that's pretty awesome that's like more than half the value of the whole box uh, so it says about this gel Pure perfumed bliss transform dull skin with deep cleansing extracts that replenish vital moisture as they purify. Steeped in hydrating shea butter, moisture rich suds restore and refresh. With jojoba oil and aloe leaf to restore lost luster, the secret to irresistibly touchable skin. One of the things I love about Library Flowers and really all Margot Elena stuff is the packaging. I love these little like, I think they're foxes kind of peeking out and it's got this like gold cap. So pretty, would look so nice in your shower, right? Still very luxe products. So that's a nice item. And then it says we've got, so if you got the regular tea subscription, you got something from Cup and Kettle, but instead of tea, I got this. So it looks like it's just coffee grounds, like, you know, for like one coffee pot, which I have a Keurig. I don't actually have a coffee pot to brew, but I do like taking these when I'm traveling so that I have good coffee instead of whatever coffee they have in whatever hotel you're in. So it says this is a $3.50 value. It says Fidalgo Coffee Roasters is a specialty only house sourcing been roasting the finest coffees since 1992. Our mission is to help you discover your perfect cup of coffee. We carry our mission out by developing a distinct, sustainable collection of blended coffees and single origin coffees sourced with only the top Arabica beans from around the world and roasted in small batches with artisan care. So um, it is a slightly lower value than the tea that you would have gotten. But again, I just don't need any more tea. So I'm happy to have a nice little uh, travel travel friendly packet of coffee and of course this is also something that's kind of fun when you're like creating your own gift boxes which is what I tend to do with all of the surplus that I have these days to kind of tuck that in for any coffee lover and I do love that they really work with uh, smaller companies that you haven't necessarily heard of and maybe turning you on to a different place so it says this is the Fidalgo Gold it doesn't actually say specifically about this blend but I'm sure that I could look it up and they are located in in Burlington, Washington. So I thought that was a fantastic tea pray love. It, again, it does feel like a nice wellness box. We've got lots of skincare. You know, we got this nice shower gel. We got the soaking salts. We
we got that extra face mask which was not in the pamphlet then we got something for the mind the soul as well right having that nice book to kind of inspire us and then just a nice little um, houseware or kitchen item with this little mug. So I thought this was great. Let me know what your favorite item in this subscription box was today. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel out. And hopefully I see you all really, really soon in my next unboxing.